Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. It's Eva from Bohemian Crafting here and today I'm coming to share with you a few uh, envelope flip books. Uh, I created those flip books with my Patreons on my Patre uh, Patreon page. And uh, I also designed a uh, few ephemeras and a uh, few, you know, those inserts for those books. Uh, that was like a huge thank you to all of my Patreons, not just separately, but to all of them, even to Patreons for one dollar because they support me well. They, they gave me so much and because of them, I had a chance to, to lean how to work with the Windows system, which drive me crazy. <laughs> I was totally lost in it. So because of them, I had a chance to learn a lot of things. I, I, I took a classes at school uh, about Windows system and about basics in graphic design. I'm still learning because those courses are pretty much uh, expensive. So I took just a few basics and the rest I'm, I'm learning myself. <laughs> I'm a student now. So... Um, some of these designs are not perfect, but I hope they like them. And uh, I already finished Christmas theme, which will be, by the way, included uh, with my kit, which I've got on my Etsy and also uh, tutorial for book. I'm, I'm planning. I've got that book right here. <laughs> I will show you just quickly. But this is flip book I created with my Patreons. These are my designs. This is my design. So all of them got those designs. <laughs> I give them choice that they can, you know, choose image they like because some of them are not perfect. Some of them I don't like. Not, not don't like, but some of them need to get better. <laughs> but I'm learning. So this is first pocket I created. Uh, all that book, it's made from envelopes and it's envelope flip book. And you can choose uh, if you will do just envelope flip book. Or this book can be actually extended like a journal. I didn't show that in that tutorial, but maybe someday. And these are uh, ephemeras I add to first uh, pocket. But maybe someday I will try to create actually journal from those books. Because I think they are pretty awesome. They gave you so much you know, Joy, I had a question from my friend who is totally not junk journal person, who is very normal, who is kind of, you know, that strictly lines, that planning everything, not any artistic feeling. And then he saw my work and he said, oh, it looks nice, but why are you doing it? He didn't understand why, why someone will like something like this, why, why someone will want to have decorated... Uh, notebook for writing notes if just you know simple notebook with lined paper with linen paper or with blank pages paper will be enough he's this way guy <laughs> and i told him because sometimes people want to have something nice something special something what will tell to others how they feel uh, what person they are here just small open but you know i will i will talk and i will just show you what is inside you don't have to probably hear that this is ephemera right <laughs> because you will see that, that this is ephemera <laughs> so i'm not gonna tell that i'm gonna show you what is inside and <laughs> i showed him uh one of these books when it wasn't finished but then <laughs> he visited me again when I had those two books finished, this one and this one, it included, included those ephemeras. Oh, I'm sorry, that was my book. Included those ephemeras and uh, those pictures which are inside and also those decorations which are inside. And so he was quiet all the time when he <coughs> went through all those pockets. And uh, when he lost some pocket, <laughs> I showed him, hey, there is one more pocket. <laughs> and in the end, he was staring at me and he said, you know what? For a moment, I felt same like I felt when I've been building up uh, my castles, when I've been small from Lego. And I was, <laughs> look at him, and he was smiling, and he was like, oh, that feels so good. I don't want that book because my <laughs> my wife will, feel, will think that I'm an idiot. <laughs> he said that, you know, but he said that he maybe now understands, which made me so happy. You know, that feeling that someone not changed his mind, but he tried to understand and he maybe get there. Why those books are cool to make? Because some some people can feel, you know, 
like a child again when they will discover new pockets and when they will put their to those pockets their own quotes and uh, you know <laughs> that was so amazing when he said that that he maybe now a little bit understand why I'm doing those books. And here we've got this beautiful oval. So that is, you know, when you when you met someone who is proper, not artistic person, who is strictly those lines, planning person, and who at the first doesn't understand. And now he said, hmm, maybe I know why you're doing it. And he was, you know, it was so amazing to watch him. Like, <laughs> his eyes, that those uh, I, I not eyelashes, over that eye. That that um, not eyebrows. I'm not sure that right word, <laughs> but not eyelashes over them <laughs> on the top when they go up and down. When he find out some new new pocket, that was woo, amazing. And I will show you in this book. In this book, he was totally amazed by, <laughs> with one pocket. <laughs> And you will know that pocket that is pretty, pretty much very easy to do. So he was totally amazed. So I'm just showing what is inside because you don't, you know, you don't have to hear me that, oh, this is Epamera. <laughs> this is Tak. So <laughs> here I've got another very loud oak <laughs> pocket. And I've got here this. So this is when you meet someone who actually don't understand why we making oh i'm gonna place it this way and to try to explain them why we making it because we want something special for us something what will tell us that days even life it's hard but days can be beautiful and if we will think positive many things will change just because we think positive you know I'm saying that my mom, all the time, mom, you can't, uh, <laughs> you can't be searching on the internet what it's this pain and what it's that pain because then you will have every single illness, you know, just think positive and everything will get better and it's true, you know, I had, uh, I been there, I done that, I think you've got the sentence, right, been there, done that. Uh, after that a car accident <laughs> everything what was painful i went on internet and i tried to look after explanation what it can be that was terrible mistake and i feel so sorry i did it because i found myself that i've got every single illness in the world really everything <laughs> everything but what they wrote i had <laughs> you know that feeling so then i stopped that i i told myself no i'm not gonna do it and again i'm not gonna search for any explanation <laughs> so this is book he was totally amazed he said oh, you know what maybe <laughs> one day i will decide you will do some journal for me that was pretty amazing so this book i created like last one here it's beautiful oh, well, i put there a little bit of a glossy accent to make it you know uh, stay last longer it's opening like this it has this over here and i used in this book i used quite a lot of that uh, rusty patina and i've got those and my mom it's at back at home now so thank you so very much to all of you for wishes to my mom She's good. Uh, my sister is amazing. You know, my sister is nurse. She's one of those totally amazing n nurses. Nurses. She's kind of nearly a doctor because uh, she was working for a very long time uh, in hospital on that uh, in that area after uh, after some really bad accidents like car crashes and you know when people have to be um, watching all the time through those windows wind, wind, window walls and they are on those monitors all the time so she's a really good one yeah and now i'm gonna jump back to my friend <laughs> he was totally amazed by this one he thought that oh hey here is uh, this is good you've got a rust here <laughs> it was like this and i told him there is one more pocket here right here he said no I can't see and then he was thinking this way i said no that's not actually pocket that's just like belly band this one see 
but maybe you now know what I mean. And this is that hide it pocket. When you slide it this way. And that that was totally amazing. How you did it. <laughs> and I've got picture there. So we can slide it back. And I have to be careful like this. So, you know, to, to see his surprise in his eyes, that was pretty amazing. Really, I was proud of myself. <laughs> that, yay, look, normal person and I surprised him. <laughs> And this one. And I'm going back to my sister. So she was working for a very long time in that very special area in hospital. So she's really awesome. Awesome. So she took amazing care about my mom. My mom is back at home now. And my mom is a very crazy person. And I mean it with love. With deep, deep love. She hates to be lazy. She hates to be at home. Because exactly that's what is happening to her when she's at home. She's searching on the freaking internet every single pain or thinking what she can have and while she was uh, back at home from my sister's uh, home she tried to find what it's uh, that pain in her knees and what it's that pain uh, which he has uh, she has sometimes at the morning here and there and she found that she've got uh, everything cancer plex <laughs> she found she she's got i don't know what and she started to be stressed so much so she decided and she's a very clever woman she knows that it's the terrible mistake to try to find something so she decided to go back to to work right that's very crazy so this is here i used a lot of that and it's everything like you know journaling space here in this journal so my mom is back at work even she supposed to be for how many years she's supposed to be you know uh enjoying her uh, retirement is it the right word retirement she's back at work because she can't be she can't be at home she's getting bored and then she's uh searching every single everything <laughs> And she gets stressed, but because she's a very clever woman, she decides, oh, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> and she went back at work. So I told her, be careful, just be careful, because, you know, she's fragile. My mommy. And like this. And we've got also a pocket here. Here is just very teeny, mini, small journal. And here we've got just, this is just like decoration, but it's pocket behind this one with oops sorry with another this divider so most of these designs you can see here my patreon get also those uh, separate images with ovals not this one that this is actually stamp those designs this one and those here small pockets all kind of pockets and here i use this is tim holtz uh tim holtz that guy and i've got their few tags and that uh the divider and this is last two pictures from this book all these books will be for sale on my etsy i'm not sure when because i am now I'm, i am now very busy with myself you know i totally felt in love with work with those digitals even i'm trying to do, do not be there too long time but it's like it's like uh, what is it how to say that like once you will try it it's not gonna let you go <laughs> it's like dropping you down <laughs> i'm not sure how to explain it but i am all over all that digital design <laughs> and these are the last two i made so i hope i will upload it soon i will also put all those kits christmas kits for on my etsy there will be uh, images I have to show you. See? This is made from that kit. Not from that kit, but I used all those papers from those kits. And I add there my designs. And uh, in that tutorial, uh, which will be included, will be how to create book like this, including those <laughs> teeny mini small touch. <laughs> so I've been very busy. I've got another two books I created this way. And oh, I love this craft. It that craft, uh, it gives you so much peace and 
time to think about things you have to think. <laughs> Here I've got this. So I really love this craft. And all my subscribers and uh, all, all, all this craft family, all ladies who are sharing their amazing books. That That's, you know, when you're watching uh, those craft videos, it's like movie. When, when you see their amazing work and uh, it's true that art, it's wonderful, wonderful, how you say that? Uh, therapy? Therapy. Art is wonderful therapy. Because people start to feel free and peaceful and relieved from any pain. So art is wonderful therapy. And I hope that more of people will join all our family. Because, you know, the time, not the time, this world, it's getting sometimes very crazy. Especially now in, in Europe when I see those news from the board, boards. Boards? borders you know between countries what is going there it's so so bad it's too much pain and too much angry and uh, so i think art is wonderful therapy therapy for all of us for anyone any anybody of us and here we've got last page <laughs> I love these books. They are amazing. There is so many pockets. I try to add so many openings. Like this here. I forgot to put there. Tuck. Uh -huh. But I try to put there as much as I can. Beautiful images. My own design. <laughs> no, really, I'm so enjoying it. That, that try to do some uh, some ephemeras. Because always when I bought some epera, ephemeras or I found some ephemeras, I was like over the moon. Oh, I've got some new. And now I can try to create myself, you know. And it's so, so amazing that I can put there my imagination and I can try and try again. Because something, oh, it's not what I wanted, right? <laughs> it's mostly not what I wanted. But I found myself now that I have to do it better because this is not right shape or this is not right shade. But shading and like vanishing images. Ah, this is something, something amazing, but also very, very not stressful. It's like drive me crazy. It's like challenge, you know. It's like challenge that do it better, Evie. Oops, sorry. <laughs> and here we've got ideas. Yes. And also, I ask my Patreons uh, for themes they would like. So I'm trying to create the themes they would like. Now, now, uh, I have so many plans because uh, it's going. Uh, I think the right word it's autumnal, right? But you've got another f fall, fall. It's for season, which is coming where is Halloween, you know. So I was thinking something for Halloween, but because I never celebrate Halloween, it wasn't normal. We've got, uh, <clears throat> it's not like celebration, it's thinking about people who passed away. That we've got, we are going to graveyard, we're putting candles in there. And there we're thinking about people who passed away in good mood, you know, to, to remember them in good mood. Not crying too much, but to feel that, that love and that we're missing them and... How, how much fun we had with them that's we we had all the time but we never had a uh, halloween like scary scary something it's going uh it's getting m more celebrate cel be celebrated in my country i'm sorry for this explanation i really don't know <laughs> how to explain it but it start to be also our uh celebrating day <laughs> Of mine. So even in my country we now start to have, you know, Halloween celebration. But because I never had that, I'm not sure you know, if I will be able to do some, some papers for Halloween. But that's the challenge I would like to try. Really, I would like to try to do some papers for Halloween. Because, you know, it's I like challenges, really. I do. I do something what I have to reach and what is not easy for me but i have to get there it's something that i really love here we've got pocket here and i've got there 
divider and that's Travia. I love this Travia card because they've got questions from one side and answers from that other side. So I can be immediately clever. <laughs> and I really love this, this oval. That was took me one all day to get. This was pretty new picture. That was new photography and I had to put everything around you know to get get away and uh, get it down with colors and as i am learning this stuff just on my own <sighs> that was pretty challenging but i really love that oh it's beautiful yeah that's all my flip books here we've got pocket i hope you don't mind that i was you know mumbling around and not about this one <laughs> but i showed you everything i hope <laughs> Sometimes I, I need to speak about things in English, you know. I've got a wonderful friend uh, to who, who I can say, whom, whom I can say anything. But it's still in my language and uh, or in Slovakian. Uh, she's a Slovakian girl and she's amazing. Really, <laughs> She's so funny and <laughs> we, we understand each other. And <laughs> when we start to talk, we don't know what, when to stop, where, yeah, when to stop. So that it's challenging as well. <laughs> Mostly for uh, that coffee, uh, co cafeteria, cafeteria owner. Because <laughs> we are too loud and too too laughing and <laughs> too much everything. <laughs> so that is challenging for them. But uh, I, we always speak in our language. And sometimes I'm missing to explain things, you know, in, in English. <laughs> so I'm talking to you guys. <laughs> So here is are my uh, four four flip books, envelope flip books. I hope you like them, and I really hope you will try them. As you can see, you can use even a uh, leather or a fabric or anything wallpapers on the top, and I believe it will looks amazing. I have quite a lot of things to share: a Christmas book, another Ovals book. One more book like this, then I do have another books to share. I got really a lot, a lot. I didn't feel the way I want to speak uh, on camera. That's why I, I I felt more like I have to create now. I have to create now because I've been in that mood, you know. And I really love my Christmas theme. And I hope my 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 uh, Patreons will love that Christmas theme as well. And these are papers uh, from that collection, uh, from that kit I've got. Uh, these are papers from that kit I've got uh, on my... I'm not sure if I've got it there now already. There, there will be there. They will be there. And uh, whoever will buy the, that kit, that Christmas kit, you will... After I will finish tutorial, <laughs> not straight away, after I will finish that tutorial, which will be in a maximum two weeks, I hope in one week, uh, you will get all images all digitals which are i hope they they are good i'm gonna show you pockets <laughs> yeah. those pockets i created for that christmas team <laughs> i love them i love this picture it's beautiful so you will get all images all all ephemeras they are not uh, journaling pages everything it's just inserts tags uh, those binders so you will receive all digitals and also links for the tutorial. So anyone will buy that kit, you will receive also all, all this stuff. So this is my sharing for flip books. I hope you like them. Thank you so very much for all your amazing comments. Thank you so much for all your amazing support. I appreciate that so much. Uh, I know I'm not answering answering uh, all your comments. Uh, but I'm reading all of them, not exactly at the same time, but always when I'm going on, on YouTube, I'm trying to give the, that one, two hours to sitting there and read all your comments and try to answer most, not most of them. Some of them I'm trying to answer in writing section and others when I do remember them, <laughs> I'm trying to answer here. By the way, I had to took off... Yes, that was what I wanted to say. I had to took off uh, the video with that frame. With that frame from toilet paper roll. I had to take it off from my uh, YouTube because I was so silly. Uh, I'm doing this. Uh, it's like routine for me how to work with that uh, isopropanol. Uh, I'm doing this for a very long time and I didn't realize to uh, say very important informations. 
uh, why I'm doing steps I did. Uh, isopropanol it's flammable. We all know that. If I will spray that it's isopropanol on that iron, that will get the fire in, fire immediately. I did those steps that I sprayed that paper roll. I let it soak, and then I flip it on that other side, just because uh, it's taking the risk of the fire really down, really because I'm not uh, heating the paper roll to long time. How to explain it? As, as long time as there will be some possibility to, to set that fire from it. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm saying that uh, the right way, but I hope you, you, you understand what I mean. And I totally forgot to say that in that video. That was really uh, unresponsible. And I'm, I'm really sorry for that, that I was so silly that, you know, it's a routine for me. And I didn't realize that. Evie, here you have to be careful what you are saying. I didn't realize that, so I had to took that video off. So this is my sharing for today. Thank you so much for sharing your time with me today. I hope you take care about yourself. And hopefully see you next time when I will share those other tunnels. <laughs> see you next time. Bye.